Hello you beautiful people and welcome back to Let's Play Diablo 2 Resurrected in another quest this time we are doing Lamb Ascent Tome and we are gonna search why do I do this quest before this one in the in order to travel to Trewinsel we need to traverse a area where we theoretically could find this quest item. Mm. This is one of the... not here, obviously, did I? Or I did sell. We are at a temple here, so let's hop into it. And yes, you are right, this is... If you have noticed it, this is obviously a new session and not the same session as before. So, let's see. We are definitely gonna still do a little bit of fighting today. I will try to pop through so I'm not in the way for our wonderful little minions. I love to call them minions. Right in, I would say I. I key. Oh, this is a bummer. Went through. They're doing a lot of damage, surprisingly. Okay, because they are champions. Were they? I think they were. Ah, and they're obviously Battlemate Serena. So the second name, not the second, but name character, and the other ones were champions. So I remembered correctly that there is... Okay, skeletons we need that this is throughout a difficult location. Oh. Best item found. That is convenient. Still, I am gonna go through here and kill a couple of items. Items, yes, obviously. A couple of enemies since they seem to drop a lot of okay the the key they are very very let's say it small them temples are small so the ruined temple seems to be a good one first of all let's refill that and then we can go on with the other quest and that is very very convenient do i need to open it up talk to alcor okay alcor is of course someone totally please him no this is it i'm still here it is for me hard to since the waves are so big to locate the right person it should give all of us here some insight into the nature of the prime evils ah but as for you in town Good day. anything okay quest completed nice then we can directly on go on with Kalim's will and travel to Trevinkel I'd say but first of all I'm gonna sell some items Okay, here we are. This is a... I actually wanted to go around the spot where we were the last time in the last episode. But then I saw this wonderful enemy group and thought, why not, right? Oh, all of them down. Nice. And we lost mana, yes, but that ain't the, the problem. Well, that actually ain't no problem at all. But quite a heavy fight it was. Heavy enemies that we can agree on, I think. It's 
so I don't know what it is. Is it either... Is it here bad luck or good luck that you have mighty enemies? But that feels kinda good. So we, in the end, if I'm going, if I go in the right direction, need to find the high console. And this is actually the location where we should have left. This is a new session, as I said, where we should have left off the last time, as far as I remember. So what do I'm gonna leave here? This one, this one, we go there, and then I can pick you up. And then let's fight through here, fight through here, and hopefully we are gonna arrive at the location in this episode. Okay, I think the, for example, the disused relic, relic, sorry, is a temple, and this should be a temple to the ruined fane. I think this, these are all one of the six temples, or one of the temples. Where we okay here we are, where we should have been, and here in this location we should uh, we are required to find the high console for what I at least we are supposed to be aware of the console. Oh okay I am so say pawn them okay can I? Please go down again. So I can attack in. Okay. Damn it. That was stupid, wasn't it? Let's see. Okay, there are some stairs. Nice. Sorry for that. But at least we know how long it is now. This is just what I wanted to check, right? How how far we can go. Sole reason, nothing more, nothing less. Night Lord, thank you. Okay, I think I'm gonna do a quick break. Sorry, I actually skipped it when I was selling stuff. This is the one with the console, uh, with the console, the quest. And I, th I, I thought because of the high console which was here. So I mixed it up, but we can in this location do two quests at once. If we are going to do this in today's episode, I doubt it, at least both of them. But I am hoping that we are going to do at least one of them. But this is something we will find out, well, in the next couple of minutes. Right, I'm gonna instantly drop them, man. Okay, let me retreat a little bit so my monsters can do the work. So, what do we have to do? There's a temple here and a weapon we need to find. I think the temple is the easy one. Can you please stop drop big items? Drop useful items, but please not big ones. <laughs> Nothing in the stash, that's too bad. Legs, nice, but not needed for us. Okay. All right, let's go up there. Why not? I can't use this yet. Would you boys be, please be so kind to come up here in order to... Yes, thank you. In order to do close combat damage. And the good part is we have the wonderful waypoint. Thank you. 
I wonder, is actually the... Which skeleton mage is the best? That I really, really, truly wonder. Oh, don't run away, baby. There's no need in hiding. Okay, they are goners. Okay, I thought there was a door, but obviously not. Could this be, theoretically, already be the council? No, I think just normal people. Well, basically, I guess I agree, not people. Weird monsters. Okay, there was something special. This should be the console, man. And yes, we gotta need to be careful. So, one is down, nice. And Kalim's fl Oh, I did not lie. Okay, we are quickly gonna go back to town, regen, and come back. Well, actually, why don't we do something like this and pick up the flail, please? Oh boy. Like that, and then we can already complete this quest. We can speak to Deckard Cain. Once properly imbued, Kalim's flail can destroy the compelling orb and reveal the way to Mephisto. Place it into the Horodric cube along with Kalim's relics, his heart, his brain, and his eye. Then transmute them to carry out Kalim's will. Okay. That we will do in a second. All right, let's put it in and then. Hello. Oh, okay. Well, it's all right, right? I'm actually gonna switch it. This is wonderful. I just noticed adds one to 119 lightning damage. The max damage I think is good. Are you two-handed or one-handed? You are one-handed. I'm not certain if I can actually keep it. So I'm gonna, sorry, this is a mess. I need to fix that. And then let's take down this, wait a second, where do we? To smash the compelling, is this the, where is the compelling orb? Is the big question. Not in town. Masterfully done, hero. You have crafted Kalim's will. Employ it to destroy the compelling orb and open the way to Mephisto. May the true light guide your way. Mm-hmm. I can't do that here. Okay, this is what we... Not in a way did want to do today. So we will go back and keep on we have forged the item i think it all has to do with those bad boys oh good what for nasty boys and i definitely want to have a town portal around Okay, let's get the hell out. All right, we have our army back. So let's slowly focus on some of them. Okay, this is then gonna be a jump in, jump out. All right, we are back in action. Let's see if we at least can take down one. Or maybe even two. Oh boy, come on. The temple's dark power is broken. 
Oh, are you kidding me? So this was... T okay, there's still a council member. So let's kill the last of them too. I am overburdened. And they dropped mighty man. Is there... Okay, there's still one remaining. And there's the orb. But the orb is something we are gonna do in the next episode, you guys. So now, this is gonna bring us to the end of this episode. And you know it, I, as usual, really, really thank you for watching. If you guys actually do have enjoyed this episode, then please give me after this. Ridding Kurast of the Council of Zakarum was essential. Still, there is more you must do. The compelling orb, too, must be destroyed. Diablo and Bale must be close to finding their brother Mephisto by now. You've no time to waste. In the next episode, for now, have a nice day. Stay frosty. Bye.